So, looking forward to working with you. We are always very happy to have you here. We are in the Electronica office and uh, I hope that our friendship and cooperation in, in, the, in the culture, of course when we say culture we say, we say technical culture, exchange of, uh, of um, uh, new technologies idea, new technologies, new, new cyber technologies and many other things in this, uh, in this field. I know that your country are very keen investing in, uh, in research and the research and, uh, is, the, is the future of every country. And uh, because you, I am sure that the research in Armenia will have a, a, a peak versus the past because the, I know your, uh, your culture, your, your, your... You have been in Armenia several times. Oh, I have been in Armenia many times, but I want to come back again after your influence in, uh, in Armenia. And I'm sure okay. that many things will change. And also as industries, we are interested to, to check and to see which kind of cooperation we could have in the past Excellent. and in the future. This is a company that is one of the leaders in the world. They are American companies, Israeli, and this company, which is the European. It's a defense company, Armenia. Yeah. Uh, it's one of the leaders in the, with the top class technology. Of course, cooperation with Armenia will be mostly on research, on mathematics, artificial Mathematic, intelligence. which means artificial intelligence. intelligence. Mm. Artificial intelligence. So this is our dream to have Armenia as one of the best places in the world with artificial intelligence. This is not something that you start tomorrow. This is not growing apples or uh, producing wine. It takes time and a very serious time because this is one of the top technologies in the world. So like other big companies, like the same Leonardo, Dassault, Thales, IBM, mm -hmm. they come to Armenia. First of all, they have to understand our potential. And the potential is existing scientists, but also the potential is the younger generation of programmers or students. So for all of them, it's very important to also have clear understanding of the educational system mm -hmm. in Armenia. So all of these big companies coming to Armenia are coming for the future, but not for tomorrow. So anybody expecting that tomorrow they will have 5,000, Mr. Benini was telling, the company has around 1,000, 1,500 workers. It looks like it's small, but it's not. Because these are, out of these 1,000 people, 500 are the best specialists in the world, mm. or at least in Europe. So you are speaking about very, very high uh, added value very high added value. So I want Armenia, we want Armenia to have relations with the best in the world. So if we want to have the next generation of artificial intelligence produced in Armenia, so we have to work with the best, okay? And this is, as I told you, it's not a mass production. It's not putting together and producing a computer or, when, or doing simple programming. I mean, we cannot compete with India, hundreds and thousands of programmers there. But we want high level. A very, very high level when you have 10 or 20 <coughs> or 50 people producing as much, in not only in volume, but in value as the, I don't know, 50,000 people. Mm -hmm. They produce something that will be living for many, many years. It will have real value for the country, for the world, but also for the sectors of development of our mean. Am I right, Mr. Benny? Absolutely correct. No other way to, to grow uh, something for the, for the new generation. And uh, only if we invest in the new generation, also in Italy uh, and everywhere, uh, a country can grow and can have a position, an in, in international position. But, but we, we hope to, to, to do that and to be successful, but... It takes time and patience and effort, hard work. Yes, take time, patience, and there is something where 
you cannot accelerate too much. It's the right time to do. You, you, you cannot become an engineer in one month. You, you need years yeah. to study and to grow and to grow. It's exactly like that.